भाइयों और बहनों राष्ट्रपति जी ने आपातकाल की घोषणा की है इससे आतंकित होने का कोई कारण नहीं है मैं आपको ये विश्वास दिलाना चाहती हूँ कि इस नए आपातकाल की घोषणा से कानून प्रिय नागरिकों के अधिकारों पर किसी प्रकार से असर नहीं पड़ेगा हु सेज दैट द इमरजेंसी वॉज एन ईविल एंड संजय गांधी Yes, there was a forced sterilization, jailing of political leaders and press censorship. But trains ran on time. This statement came amidst the controversies from Jagdish Khattar, who was ex-CMD of Maruti Udyog. We tried to find the truth in this statement, but there's none except one. Noida. One day, Sanjay Gandhi was sitting with a Delhi man. He asked the chief minister to locate a site on the east side of the Yamuna River. This area would serve as a new home for industries causing pollution, particularly those from Okhla, which is Delhi's only industrial zone. He believed it would help clean up Delhi. They had 3 days to locate a suitable place and present a detailed plan by Friday. Jagdish Khattar, a retired bureaucrat, led Maruti Udyog as CMD. and served as the first ceo of noida he talked about how noida was made calling it illegal in official papers even though he disagreed he was still chosen to set up the new industrial area that year the december was far colder not like now the villagers were sitting wrapped in blankets when we went to find a suitable location recollects khattar in two days sanjay gandhi arrived in an old matador was accompanied by Jack Mohan who was the vice chairman of Delhi Development Authority Sanjay was shown the possible options he selected a patch of land where Noida was founded he insisted that work on this industrial area should start on Monday Khattar at an opportune moment informed his C Tiwari in whispers the time is too short the land has not been acquired and belongs to the farmers starting any work at this time would be illegal sanjay gandhi overheard the whispers and asked if there's a problem he assured the people present on the day that on monday bulldozers will come and work will start the work started as per schedule there were glitches red tape and rules of land acquisition but sanjay gandhi had made up his mind the government of up decided to form a separate agency an authority that was to carry out the works rapidly as it was difficult to manage matters sitting at the state capital khattar was assigned the top job he created a committee featuring a senior judge to develop rules for the emergency situation addressing any gaps in the existing relations these rules will govern the functioning of the authority and the whole plan was to shift industries from okla to some new place the committee for this task was named as new okla industrial development authority the acronym subsequently became the name of the city to the east of yamuna which today we called as noida since the authority had so much to accomplish in so little time khattar made sure it has the autonomy to acquire land and also ensured financial autonomy He sought the creation of a corpus and seed money to buy land and expedite the development work. When the proposal reached the finance department of Uttar Pradesh, they raised a red flag. They were not ready to award financial autonomy to Noida. After the emergency, when the Janata Party government came to power, an inquiry was ordered into the making of Noida. Court summons were issued to Sanjay Gandhi, N. D. Tiwari. district magistrate b n tiwari and chakdish khattar the officers weren't spared but khattar was saved because he had noted categorically in the file that this is illegal work but was overruled by political process after much back and forth the city of noida officially came into administrative existence on 17th april 1976 which is now celebrated as noida day the city lies in the cultural region of braj It was set up as part of an urbanization thrust during the controversial emergency period. The city was created under the UP Industrial Area Development Act 1976 by the initiatives of Sanjay Gandhi. 
The city has the highest per capita income in the Uttar Pradesh ahead of Lucknow. Noida is classified as a special economy zone (SEZ). The Noida Authority is among the richest civic bodies in the country. If we keep all the political bazaar out of the discussion and focus this beautiful city of Noida, since the establishment, it has created a new records in every aspect. The city is designed in such a way that it is the satellite city of Delhi.